What's up you guys? It's your girl Lo, back with another video. And today I just finished editing the um, like beach winery day video. I didn't get to make an intro this day because I actually went to work in the morning. I had to get up at like five, six o'clock in the morning um, to go to work until 12. And then the train was at 138 from South Station. And I get really high anxiety when it comes to being like on time for things so i have to be at places like a good half hour early even though if it's so unnecessary to do that um so because of that i got home at like 12 38 and i wanted to be at the station by like 1 15 and i would have been good we made it by 1 16 due to me rushing for absolutely no reason and just throwing shit in my bag like i didn't even the real outfit i wanted to wear never had time to like put it together and pack it i just threw that dress in my bag um and literally had my dad just like take me as quick as possible and we ran out the door um i literally arrived at 1 16 completely unnecessary to get that at that time i mean i was literally able to stop and get mcdonald's let inside the station and like sit and eat with natalie so yeah but anyway only good thing about having anxiety though for me is at least i'm on time to shit anyway so besides the point i hope you guys enjoy the video this was so much fun i learned a lot about wines i am definitely a sweet wine person if i'm gonna get a special drink i call it a special drink because normally i just drink water and milk or whatever and it's totally fine but if i'm going out i normally get like a drink that has some sort of fruity or sweetness like it needs something um that has a good sugar level in it so i think that's why i'm more prone to the sweet wines i don't really like the bitter like 90 percent of those wines we tasted in the beginning of this video i was very like eh. um but the dessert wine you'll see the dessert wine was that was where it was at um it got your girl a little a little tipsy or whatever um but yeah okay hope you guys enjoyed the video i'm gonna stop babbling now let's just get into it Like that, and then taste them from top to bottom. 
What's my first Last one? The first oh. one is the first one. Yeah, have, so this one? The same. Okay, cool. The the vital blanc. This is the yeah. Vital Blanc. My number two is Vital Blanc. Oh, okay. So I want to go shard though. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> do you know why I do this? You see how fast it just goes. <laughs> oh, thank you go. so much. Thank legs. That's so called legs. legs. Yeah, legs. You're, check it. You're checking out at mm -hmm. legs. <laughs> I don't really Maybe you don't say it that way. That's not, <laughs> that's not a classy way to say it. I'm just joking around. What does it like to mean? Bill, you're one to five. I did one to five. Frank, I'm on numero two. I did chaos. Two. Yeah, same. You can't be a pretty good one. I have to pass for my number three. Oh my oh, god. god. Uh, okay, yes, cheers. You should just rotate the yours. Yes, cheers. Yeah. I do like. I don't, I don't need that. Don't hate that. I think I like the Chardonnay more. More. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this one's good. I like that. I'm just gonna crack a little bit and see what's going on. This has a little bit of a, a spicy note. I feel like. Mm. I'm going to my third one. Mm. I know. I almost like don't want to like finish. I'm like polishing them. Yeah. Like, I feel like I should wait and come back to them. Okay, so now I'm, this is my chaos. This is chaos. my cab Frank Rosé. That's my fourth one. <laughs> oh, I think that'll be good. I bet you you'll like that one. That was better. I'm giving you a three. Three? So mm -hmm. you're going up in the rankings? Yeah. I like the this one is my, my unoaked. This is 2020 aroma. This is getting darker. This is my Frank Rosé. Oh, I think I like, I think I like oak better than unoaked. I don't know, I can't tell. I kind of like this one for some reason. I'm a red girl too. Red is my favorite. Yeah. This is the 2018 Merlot. Mine is the yeah, I have a Merlot. I'm Oak Merlot. Yeah. We all have a Merlot. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 I don't love that. I don't mind it. It's just very it's different. It's different. It's different. Mm -hmm. The watery. Yeah. It goes down very easily. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, well, I feel like a, a, a good this red wine. Yeah. I feel like it does that. Like, because yeah. I feel like when you drink like a crappy red wine stuff, it's like kind of like a yeah, it's like a harsh gulp. Yes. A good red wine is supposed to be like that. Okay. Because anyway. this isn't the red like the red I'm used to. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. I mean, there are different. Excuse me. Seven seven dry. The dog. The blonde. The vintage. Okay, we'll do a little, it's like a book pass yeah. situation. Yeah, <laughs> 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 different from what you were expecting, I'll tell you that. Oh, God. <laughs> it's, it's good, but it's very different. Dry? No, like, it tastes more um, alcoholic. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that's interesting to look at it. Yeah, too. it is just different. Oh, um, my God. It's like super oaky, honey -ish. It looks like, it's like sparkly. That's very strong. That's so yeah. strong. <laughs> I think one sip of that would knock my mother out. You guys should try to drive me now. Yeah. I meant to warn you about it. No, it's mm -hmm. good. It's good. I was it's under dessert wine, so mm -hmm. yeah. a lot of people expect it to be sweet, but it is the opposite of sweet. Yeah. It's good. I, I like it. Like it. Sure. I like it's like it too. Oh, this one's 20, so. <laughs> Let's get it. Is that the Vinho? This one's the, yeah, Vinho. Abahado. Dessert wines are I'm weird. Scared. So weird. <laughs> it doesn't. That one doesn't taste nearly as alcohol. It's fairly sweeter, but it's like definitely like I almost get the raisiny thing. Like, Whoa. They're very different. That's very. This one has legs. Too. They're like sticky. I'm giving you a three. That was interesting. Really? That was three. What was the other one? One. Immediate one. That first one was a wow. one. Wow. Yeah. That was not what I was it expecting thick, at all. Like it's, it's not like thick, thick, yeah, but yeah. it has a thick yes. taste. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like it. Yeah, I, I like, like that, that little sweet coat. Ooh, this is yeah. giving me honey vibes. Yeah. 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 Y
Is that the first one? The first I, one? I, are you trying to polish that one off? I'm good with that? it. If you want that. Hello, you want to start our third one? Imposter. Light red wine resulted from a second fermentation of grape skins and fortified with grappa, aged, or further aged oak, or French oak, sweet and smooth. Ooh, I like that. Mm. Sweet and smooth sounds like what I like. Yeah, I like yeah, that. I have a yeah. feeling that one's the one that I was gonna check off just because of the name of the imposter. I did check I like that. that. <laughs> I did check that one. <laughs> that sounds fun. I like Navigator. that one. Ooh. It's definitely sweet. <laughs> and I like that. This is the sweetest one I've tasted. Yeah, that's very sweet. Yeah. I like it a lot. And it was smooth. Mm hmm. <laughs> I would take a glass of that. Yeah. I would take a glass okay. of that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Natalie leaned out and then she came back two shades better. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she said, oh. You are doing it. Alright. Go for it. Whatever you want with that. I like that one. You like that one? Yeah. So this is a big fan imposter. Yeah. Okay, yeah. now you start it off. I'm gonna close my pot real quick. Yeah, oh yeah. At least we can, you can eat some snackies in the car too. Mm -hmm. Yes. Navigator? Uh, song. Yes, navigator. Tell me if it's sweet. I'm not going to lie, um, they're all tasting the same to me. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> it says nutty, but that doesn't mean nut. Okay. I think that would be like, in there. I like that better than this one Well, thing. because it might be a tree nut, so maybe the barrel is made from the tree. I'm no, allergic so to tree nuts. I know, but oh. it's not the actual nut. It's oh, like I see what you're saying. It's yes. the wood, the yeah, yeah. I think I like that one better than this one. Maybe oh, I like that. Yeah. I like that. I think it's a little, little bit lighter. Yeah. But I don't know. Like, I'm not, I don't I think like I'm a big fan a of the design of wines in general. Because it's honestly, they all taste kind of syrupy to me. Like, oh, you know, like yeah, yeah, yeah. That one was the most syrupy to me. Yes. The very thick one. Bridget. Polish rock. <laughs> this is so cool. I love these little cups. They're so cute. Yeah, they're really cute. Yeah, they just, I don't know. I don't think I'm a big fan of dessert wines. They're just very, like... Yeah, I know what you mean. Whew. It's strong. Yeah, like, I, I like, like this one well. way more than number four. Yeah, mm. yeah. yeah. I, I, don't, I think I like that one. Yeah, I like it. it. <laughs> so I'm gonna take this one to the... I like so it. It's, it's definitely strong. So mine... The highest ranked was Imposter, which is what? This one? Yeah, I think so. And then that one. Yeah. I didn't rank these, but if I had to guess, honestly, I I really liked this first one. It was very different from these. I think this yes. one tasted the less, the least syrupy. But these ones all tasted cozy. These, these three taste the same to me. These two stuck well, out the most. No, these two actually taste the same. This one was very syrupy in a different way. Yeah. This one was yeah. unique, but I like this one the most, I think. Mm. At least I know I don't really like dessert wine. See, I'm, I'm the opposite. Yeah, see, well, there we go. You learned something. I now, like right? the dessert wine. Those see, like, I just feel like if I was to drink those one of these, hits. like, like I could have one of these if it was exactly what it says. It's supposed to be like a dessert wine. Like, after a meal, I could have a glass. But, like, yeah. I couldn't get drunk on any of them. Oh, but, I could get drunk. <laughs> I'm like, I, I could get drunk. I just wouldn't want to. I'm tipsy right now. <laughs> <laughs> no, you say, I am feeling it. I like that. Oh, my face is red. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I'm feeling a little tipsy. I know that if I had two more of those um, imposter drinks, I'd probably be riding those cows from outside because that's how drunk I would be. Um, so yeah, but that's how I'm feeling. Very much tipsy, but not drunk. Um, but yeah, I know that I like the imposter. It's a dessert wine, sweet. And it tastes good, but it's not too syrupy because the one before that was very syrupy. This one was not as syrupy. Um, and then out of the ones I drank before that, I think my favorite was the. Excuse me, Bridge. Give me a moment. Was the 2020 Cab Franc Rose and the 2020 Aroma Roses. Very good. Hi. How are we feeling? Great. 
I have to drive, so if I said anything else, I'd be bad. Yeah. Natalie? I feel really good. Yeah. <laughs> Like I'm happy. Yeah. Very happy. Oh my god, my face is so red. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Asian that's, glow. It, that's it. I'm very happy. I love my friends. <laughs> oh god. My girls. <laughs>